Good afternoon everyone. This is Eli from Kingsborough Autos in Leeds, West Yorkshire. And this afternoon I've got for you an absolutely stunning bit of kit. It's the 2019 BMW X5 M50D. Now for those of you who don't know, this replaces the previous X5 and it is a million miles better in so many ways. Uh, not just the looks, but the technology is outstanding. Uh, and I would say, out of all the cars I sold, or have sold, or are selling, uh, the technology in this car pretty much outweighs all of them. Uh, I know I've said that about um, the Porsche's current range of SUVs, but uh, BMW really have taken it to the next level. If you are looking for an SUV, um, a large 4x4, this is way ahead of the competition. Really, really good. So I'll run through some of the features with you today uh, and talk a little bit about this particular model that we have for sale. So this is a February 2019, so it's not a, not even a year old yet. And it's currently done about uh, just over 7,000 miles. Supplied by BMW main dealer with a very, very high spec. First of all, uh, well, let's just tell you, it's roughly around uh, 85 to 90,000 pounds new this car with these options it's got about just over 15,000 pounds of options uh, and we're selling it to you today for 59,995 so 60,000 pounds a great saving for a car that's not even a year old yet uh, that's ready to go now you don't have to wait for it to be built and it's got all the best options so this car comes in the first uh, fantastic option that it's got is the mineral white paint now this is um, this is like a pleasant it's not a flat white at all it's like a pleasant uh, metallic color um, very deep and when the sun hits it in certain angles you can see all the different layers it really does sparkle you can just about see it there really really nice paint color now these cars have the fantastic three liter straight six engine they've actually updated it now to four turbos so it's a quad turbo engine uh, which means you've got instant torque uh, there's no lag whatsoever producing 400 horsepower 0 to 60 in about five seconds yet still does around 40 odd miles to the gallon on the combined cycle i mean what more could you ask for efficiency and power and space this car's got the four corner air suspension as well it's also got the rear wheel steering essential for tight turning angles and better handling and the air suspension, air suspension you can raise and lower as you wish uh, power tailgate got the lovely exhaust poking out the back there with the rear diffuser there in the body color led lights all round privacy glass uh, gloss black roof rails and gloss black uh, window surrounds pr to uh, to finish it off instead of the chrome uh, nice option to have 22 inch by Calalo wheels with Prelli P0 tyres and the M Sport braking system which is the very large I think the four pot or six pot blue calipers there with the M logo on them you've got the M logo on the side there as well and the matching uh, wing mirrors that actually match the, the wheel colour uh, with built in indicators, cameras etc keyless entry and exit as part of the comfort pack we'll get into that in a minute when we go around the inside of the car adaptive led headlights that huge 2019 bmw grills they're putting on all the top cars really gives it um, a distinctive aggressive appearance that sets it out I mean, it's just so much different than the previous model. You can see the radar sensor and the camera there in the front as well. Hands down, this is actually one of the best cars I've driven of this year. Just in terms of the technology, how advanced it is and comfort, everything. It's just a really good car. If I was going to have a car as a family car that I kept, it'd be this one. That's how much I like it. Bodywork, as you can appreciate, mint condition, wheels mint condition, tyres all excellent. Pretty much like brand new, really, the car. 
barely been used. The chap that I bought it from owned several vehicles. Um, so yeah, it wasn't, uh, hasn't been used that much at all. So let's talk about some of the tech and we'll go around to some of the interior features as well. You can see the camera at the back there, but first of all, let's look at the boot. So it's a split tailgate like you get in Range Rovers, which I particularly like. You can lower the suspension for loading with that button and that button lowers the lower tailgate. And on the main tailgate, you've got the close and lock function there with the right hand side button or the left hand side button just closes the boot. Easy drop down seats. You literally just pull down these levers on each side, 12 volt socket there first aid kit there. Underneath you've got a lovely gas strut that pushes the lower floor up, you only to hold it up. You've got locking wheel nut, etc. All in its correct place. And the load space covers there as well. Of course you've got that open sky panoramic roof. Okay so let's close the tailgate. So you press that button there. Walk up to the car, pull the handles and it opens. You've got blinds in the rear. That was a nice option to have if you've got children. Harman Kardon sound system, speakers pretty much everywhere. Fantastic sound quality. You've got LED lighting all around the car which is configurable. I've set it to green but you can have a number of different colours from purple to blue, pink etc. Still got the plastic there on the M logo stainless steel trims. This has got the extended leather interiors. You've got black leather with white stitching on the doors, dash and on the seats of course. And then you've also got the sort of diamond quilt pattern as well which just makes it look so much nicer. You can see there the uh, the LED lighting there in the door. It's also got the gloss black, piano black trim uh, option, which again looks really nice. Lighting underneath the seats there. Yeah, there's lighting all around with the ambient lighting. Uh, at night, the whole roof lights up as well. It's got loads of little LEDs in it. So you can have, you can, again, you can configure the color of that for whatever color you want. Heated seats at the back as well. That's the rear. Let's walk around to the front passenger side. Oh, let's talk about, you've got um, blind spot assist there, so you can see the comes in your blind spot, flashes up in the wing mirror with the orange triangle. Again, the black leather with white stitching on the doors, memory settings, piano black trim, LED lighting, Same again on the on the dash there on the main dashboard you've got the black stainless steel LED and then the black leather with white stitching. Really really nice quality. You've got the comfort seats here, with multiple adjustments. You've got the crafted glass package which gives you that lovely it's so worth it it's must, it's a, really is a must have lovely gear selector and control wheel for the media air suspension there handbrake hill descent control auto hold then your different settings for the car which tune the, the steering or the gearbox the engine etc and suspension is how you want it start stop button all the camera buttons there and then all the buttons for the iDrive and then in here you've got your heated and cooled cup holders and your wireless phone charger and USB and then in here you've got further, further uh, that's a micro USB socket there which is what you need for all the modern phones because that's what it's all going to so you've got micro and normal the LED lighting there and button for the roof 
lovely hand stitched contrast white stitching against the black leather on the M steering wheel what a fantastic car full digital dash electric steering column adaptive headlights with the auto high beam assist so let's talk about the options I've got I've done a quick list here DAB tuner uh, for your DAB radio technology package uh, so that includes your head-up display let's see if we can get that oh before we do it also includes the display key so let's just show you that because that is a piece of art in its own right so that's the key and um, see if I can oh, let's turn it that way slide up to unlock oh, put that instead okay that'll work better slide up to unlock display set time departure so you've got the connected drive on this car as well so you can actually control the car from your app on your phone your current range how much is left you can control the car from from the key and um, also from the app on your phone that you can download uh, you can also, it's got the connected drive, uh, sorry, BMW Live Cockpit, I think it's called, uh, which is also very clever in terms of finding the best routes for where you want to go on your navigation, uh, avoiding traffic, etc. Um, the good thing about this key is you just keep it in your pocket and the car automatically locks and unlocks itself as you get close uh, or walk away. You don't need to press anything or touch any handles on the doors like you do with most keyless systems. Um, that's part of the comfort package and another thing that comes with the comfort package is those heated and cooled cup holders which actually work very well uh, to keep your drinks hot and cold you've got the uh, heated and cooled seat as well okay um, and um, you also get uh, the keyless as I said keyless entry exit and start the start buttons there and uh, the comfort seats so the comfort seats are actually uh, an option as opposed to the standard seats and they give you much more configurability uh, with the adjustment and uh, are just more comfortable to sit in and easier to get comfortable because of the range of adjustments that you've got. All your automatic light controls there. You can see on here you've got the BMW uh, professional driving assistant which was a two and a half thousand pound option and it is so worth it let's just uh, start it up fantastic digital dash there you can flick through that right hand side menu um, with the buttons here infinitely configurable and um, obviously it can display your nav and your driving assistant and everything else on on the main dash and then obviously you've got this screen here as well and then that screen there a lot of screens you've got head-up display there now this head-up display is so much more advanced than what you see on most other vehicles it's um, it actually can uh, display all that screen there all the navigation instructions on uh, on there as a sort of like screenshot almost it's very clever difficult to explain but when you use it you'll see and it is fantastic um, so that's part of the technology package as is the key and then you've got the 360 parking so we press that button there is it this one yeah so you've got park assist where the car actually park itself reversing assist there uh, and obviously you can adjust the camera picture etc so you've got the 360 area view camera there and then the normal camera there all this is completely adjustable so you can play about with it as much as you want uh, other viewpoints there I mean it's, it's literally you could spend hours in this car just messing around with everything now also with the technology package you get the live recorder so on the app you can actually record um, 
pictures all around the car when the car's parked so you can look at what the cameras are recording what the cameras are seeing on your phone when the car say parked up outside your house uh, or parked up outside a shop if you're worried someone's potentially going to tamper with it very good very good and handy feature to have let's say you, you want to see a, a warden giving you a ticket you could see that obviously not the nicest thing but there you go uh you got the privacy glass as i said the piano black trim there which is lovely and um individual bmw individual leather you can see there it's embroidered on the seats which gives you all that extended leather pretty much everywhere which is definitely worth having wi-fi hotspot you've got all that um so the driving system professional that is really really probably one of the most advanced i've found on most cars so not only does it keep a set distance of the car in front it also actually um stops accelerates with traffic you don't need to touch accelerate do anything like you do most other cars it just does everything by itself so literally you can be in a traffic jam and not do a thing the car will do everything very very clever and worth having um and just gives you um make makes driving a traffic jam really really easy uh, this is a very very important option i wouldn't buy a car without this uh, and then it also gives you lane assist so it actively it will actively um keep the car within the white lines and steer it back in if you drift out so you won't go far wrong and you can feel the steering wheel moving if you do drive for more than a few minutes with your hands on the steering wheel it'll actually flash up a warning there and say you know, please put your hands on the steering wheel which you have to touch it there and then it'll it'll come back off and it's also got automatic braking so if it detects a collision it will break the car for you if you're not looking um, side collision protection as well um, crossroads warning and evasion aid so it's a very clever system pretty much makes the car um, I wouldn't say uncrashable but <laughs> it does a lot of the thinking for you so it takes a lot of the mistakes and error human error that you could possibly make out um, in addition to that obviously you've got the panoramic roof which I've mentioned the crafted glass the suspension the air suspension which you can adjust uh, the roller sunblinds I mentioned the ambient interior lighting which you can configure Harmacan sound system adaptive LED headlights high beam assistant there uh, you can control the silly things like you can control the um, passenger seat from here uh, you press that button let's just put that in the park take that off so if I press that button there and then I adjust this seat yeah I can actually adjust the passenger seat if I wanted to make to match the driver's seat or whatever else I want to do with it uh, so again quite clever why do I want to do that I don't know but it's good to do if you want to um, and then uh, obviously you've got power folding mirrors etc boot release memory settings etc but it's a very very clever car ladies and gentlemen I strongly suggest if you're in the market for a full-size SUV this should be high up on your list and do you know what with the M50D there's not much difference in fuel economy and running cost compared to the 30D but you get so much more performance uh, and drivability and features that you don't get in the other models is definitely worth going for this one over the others um, it really is worth every penny and uh, that is pretty much it so I will uh, leave it with you I look forward to receiving your calls emails questions on the car um, hopefully I've given you enough detail there there's certainly more information on the BMW website if you want to look into each of the individual options and how they all work uh, which, which, which is what I've done um, but uh, I certainly have done quite a bit of homework, so feel free to ask me, and if I know, I will of course help you as much as I can. So that's our 2019 M50D. I look forward to hearing from you shortly. All the best to you on the next video, and have a good new year.